Hi there guys and welcome back to some more Madden 11 franchise mode. Uh, we're going into week 5 against the Kansas City Chiefs and today I'm going to be repping the kickers. I have my Pat McAfee jersey on right now. I have my Adam Vinatieri jersey for uh, one, of the, one of the games after this. So yeah, let's get into the game against the Chiefs. Today's game is brought to you in HD by EA Sports and Madden NFL 11. Our side is pretty... Dumps it out right. Oh, it's a screen. That's no good. Got oh, Sanders. There we go. Third and one. Charles almost broke it. I wasn't expecting it to be a screen, but then I guess Jamal Charles is the focal point of their offense. Oh, it's play action. That I fell for that hard. Jesus. Charles still isn't back in the game, so. Go on, Lacey. Unlucky on the. On that. Oh, Garcon's in the slot now, so that's good. There we go. That's the one we wanted. First down. It's a great catch from Reggie Wayne. I'm waiting for them to. Good coverage downfield. Fucking hell. Absolutely sent everything. We are struggling here. Oh, is this good? Yeah, it's good. Vinatieri's kick is up and good, and we take a three-nothing lead. <clears throat> of course, it's a yes, a screen. I knew it. Read that like a fucking pro. Session with a pick. That's what happens when you throw too many screens in one game. Eventually, when you're in man coverage, the linebacker's gonna get there. What a play! I like Wayne on a streak here. I also like Clark there. Touchdown. Colts. There we go. Take a 9 nothing lead. Uh-oh. Bracket just about able to catch up with Cooper. Christ. Thought that was it. Oh, Hayden. I definitely thought that was a pick. Now, this looks like cover two. And if it is... It is. Which means that Clark is that open there. No, it looks like they're sending a blitz, so maybe Garcon. He needs to get rid of it. And there's Garcon deep downfield. There we go. If nothing's there, we don't need to extend the play. We just want to... Looking for a man. <gasps> Wayne has caught that for a touchdown. That is an unbelievable touchdown. grab. I think it hit him in the face cage and then dropped into his hands. If that had dropped incomplete, we still would have had a second. But my word, what a play from... Manning and Wayne. All right. Oh, that's Keeps nice blocking. Couldn't quite put him on skates. I thought 44 was going to uh, going to over overrun it. He gets 23 yards on that one. Garcon in the slot is where I want to go. No one else really is going deep. So, and Garcon's there. Great catch. First down. Okay. He's searching for a receiver. Oh, Clark has got the catch and the first down. That is unbelievable. That's twice now we've had two long conversions on third down. Bit of misdirection. Nope. And you love to see This will mean they need three touchdowns to beat us. He splits the upright. Twenty nine yards today for a die. To be fair, I've never been great at running the ball on any Madden. Barely gets it on. <gasps> it's a great. Who was that Lacey getting to the quarterback there? Goes through his progression. Oh, Wayne. Watch out. Broke ankle. With two seconds to go, Vinatieri's kick is up and good. Our final in this one is Indianapolis. 23, Kansas City. This Nothing. has been a presentation of EA Sports and Madden NFL 11. We're now on to week six against the Redskins. Uh, I've changed into my Adam Vinatieri jersey now. So yeah, we're going to hope for a big game from him, a big game from the offense, and take ourselves to 6-0. So let's get into the game. Today's game is brought to you in HD by EA Sports and Madden NFL 11. We'll go smash here and hopefully... Hit Dallas Clark down the seam, provided this stays in a cover two look. 
It only looked like they're rushing through. It's a cover three look, but Clark was open because the the linebacker was on his outside rather than the inside. So we're looking Clark here, but it does look like a cover three instead of a uh, or cover one instead of cover two. Oh, hit Gonzalez over the mid. Well, <clears throat> on the drag, and uh, he goes out after 23 yards. But we're gonna, well, we're gonna try and follow Robinson up the hole, but he got stuffed. I think we should have gone play action there, but we're gonna go for the field goal. And Vinatieri. I just realised why are we playing in blue and the Redskins in white? I don't know, but. Vinatieri's kick should be good. A lot of wind, but we did compensate for it. They run the toss. It's Portis, and we get there after just two yards. Kelvin Hayden with a great tackle. <coughs> so Brandon James has the opportunity to return the punt. Bidwell's kick is short. Forcing us to return it. Oh, we fumbled it. That's not a good sign. Ah. That's not good. That's not what we wanted. Should have called a fair catch because everybody was in my face. And that's what happens. And so, of course, we force a sack. Oh, Cooley has just made a great catch who was that I think that was Lacey out there McNabb really with a poor pass I would say was it Lacey or was it Powers it's Powers trying to knock it away and Lacey comes across to actually make the tackle that's really poor I just feel like we're going to end up oh that's a touchdown for, for the Redskins this is the first time that we've been behind all season it's a cover three look in fact it's a man look but Tom Santi's going to come down with the ball over the halfway line it looks like it might have worked and there's Dallas Clark open over the middle and we were lucky it was just over the head of the linebacker it's play action I don't think they're going to fall for it but maybe we'll get Clark open or Gonzalez. Gonzalez is coming up big this season with big touchdowns in in positions that we really needed to uh, to get a score, and that's his third of the season. <laughs> Kelvin Hayden comes up with a massive pick. I wasn't sure whether he was going to get there and try and return it. Aiden gets down inside the 30. We're going to go play action. Hopefully, Garcon will get open. And there he is. It was a, it's quite a badly placed ball, really, for Manning, but that's uh, neither here nor there. But Clark comes open. I don't think he will. I think we're going to be looking at Gonzalez again. There's Gonzalez for his second touchdown. He's been the main man today. Hello there. Lacey has a pick and that's... Oh, I thought that was going to go back for six. I was not expecting Lacey to be there. Everyone crossing basically on this. There's Gus on. And he's down at the one yard line. It's a die up the middle and he gets in. We go back to that cover one look. But they go five wide. Oh, Chris Cooley just absolutely sold me a sold me down river. But that is not what we wanted. Santana Moss there going deep. Oh, that's a great catch from Moss. And a good gap and a die 10 for 45 gets 10 yards there there's Gonzalez and he gets the first down at the 6 yard line Washington take their second time out so we're going to have Wayne on a slant and we're going to look at Robinson here or Clark and Dallas Clark makes the catch 
We want to keep them inbounds. Kelvin Hayden comes up with his second pick. He's wrestled down at the 22. He's had a great few weeks. A die after the motion of Santi goes up and he gets the first down at the 11 yard line. Vinatieri's kick is up and it should be good. And there we go. Our final score is the Colts 34, the Redskins. This has been a presentation of EA Sports and Madden NFL 11. Today's game is brought to you in HD by EA Sports and Madden NFL 11. We will cover the. Uh, oh. Stuck on a lineman. Still looking for an open man. Surprise, Gary motherfucker. Gary Brackett picks up the first pass from scrimmage from Daniels. Matt Sharp. He threw it into the flat, and Brackett trailing managed to break on the ball. Daniels had no chance on that ball. I always like these corners with Clark um, on them. He always seems to be able to break his uh, break from his man. It's zone coverage as well. That should be. Uh, well, here's the first down, and we're inside the 10-yard line. And this time, we're going to go play action from the 5-yard line. Hope to hit either Robinson or Clark, but anybody that's open, obviously, will we will take. Instead, I think we did this before, where we run it in with Manning. There, Hayden is the deep defender, but oh, I've just completely run around where the ball was. That's terrible. That should not have been there. That should have been a second pick for Sharp, not a uh, not a 42-yard completion. I'll take bracket here. Rolling out to his right. His pass. Oh, an 85. Is that Joel Dreesen? Drops the pass. Should have been a completion, but he had uh, Session rolling up on him there, about to blow him up. Bracket is the uh, the spy. Not that I expect Sharp to. Uh, Oh, it's picked by Powers, and that should be a pick six. Well, who's that? 21. Stay away. Is that Aaron Foster actually back? No, it's Moats. Where is Aaron Foster? I feel like it's going to be Santi or Clark that's going to be the guy that we go to here. As Santi finds a hole in the zone. But we're going to run it up the gut. And... Uh, See what Adai can do for us, because we haven't utilised him in the way we should have, really. You know, oh, wow. how that is not a fumble. You cannot be telling me that that is a fumble. I think we got it back, but that is not a fumble. But I think we're going Robinson or Clark here, really. Oh. <laughs> Okay, they sent everybody and Cushing just absolutely wrecked Manning there. Okay, excellent. Vinatieri now with the uh, field goal. Should be good. And there it is. We take a 10-0 lead with just under two minutes to go. I've never really been a good player at running the ball, so we'll, we'll keep it at that, I guess. <laughs> we'll just carry on with what I'm good at. That's the pass. Brackett has picked up the pass. as our third interception of the game. And Brackett takes it back for six. See them get burned on passes like oh, that. We're using the other defensive tackle now. And finally we get to uh, to Sharp. I think that's Mathis. They are going for a field goal. It's a field goal return look. So it is, It's good. It's off the post and it's through. Brown's kick from 55 yards is good. And we're going to run the sweep here. Is it with a die? Following the block of hopefully Clark and uh, the, the left guard, who we're hopefully going to replace. Oh, that's lovely. Made a huge hole. We may well hit Gonzalez or most likely Garcon. That's lovely. Garcon got beyond his man. And he's out of bounds at the eight yard line. All right. We're going to look Clark here because he was wide open. The defender was not tight on him at all. And it's a touchdown. Go cover two. They dropped everyone. Dwight Freeney with the pick. And he's going to run it in for a touchdown. I didn't even know I was controlling Freeney. I just co I just covered that guy and Freeney comes up with a pick six. You know, it's a cover two, man. No! 
No, not again. Every time. Every time I change to my corner, he just ends up getting screwed. Nope. But they had with the pick. And we take over at our own six. Five interceptions for Matt Sharp. Matt Sharp has been picked off twice by Bethea. He was the only guy that got a pick in the first game as well. And it looks like a cover one look. And that's Dallas Clark. He might go all the way. Dallas Clark has got to go 89 yards for the touchdown. And that takes him up over 100 yards for the day, I think. Our final score is Indianapolis 38, Houston 3. This has been a presentation of EA Sports and Madden NFL 11. That's it for this episode of my Colts Madden 11 franchise mode. Let me know what your favourite touchdown was that we scored this episode. Or what your favourite moment was. Personally for me, I think it's Dwight Farini getting the pick six in that Texans game. But as always guys, thank you for watching. If you have any feedback for me, please let me know in a comment below as well. And if you want to keep up to date with everything that I'm doing, including more Colts franchise mode on Madden 11, then please subscribe. And I will see you next time.